Hi everyone, and welcome. It's Black Shadow here, I'm being fairly well. Got some nice things planned perhaps for this weekend. It is channel update time for September 2024, and uh, I'm pleased that I've actually managed to keep things rolling along pretty darn well uh, over the course of August. We've been surprisingly busy, um, and we've had plenty of content coming out on the channel, which is good, given everything going on, with my own bits and pieces, obviously my time also spent on hidden assets, uh, we have Dune Imperium, which is still kind of on break at the moment, so, you know, that's not a big deal. Um, however, um, there's also, as I mentioned in the last update video, uh, I've taken up um, a role as a competitive e-gaming referee, uh, which is going on pretty well so far, um, although balancing that alongside all the other channel stuff is going to be interesting going forward we'll we'll go with that it's uh i'm sure it'll be fun anyways uh moving on from that it's about what's been going on with the channel so far and you can see the beginning video here for Parasite eve's her third birthday which we started about two weeks or so ago uh, one of a few series ongoing currently. We'll talk about this first briefly, I suppose. Uh, I've been enjoying my time with the game, largely speaking. Uh, we do have the next part of that coming up later tonight. Uh, and then the next video of that is I actually sat down for about 20 minutes or so and basically gave my review of the game. Um, I talk about everything that I've seen so far. Um, I talk about what I have liked, what I haven't particularly thought was great. And also talked about some of the kind of creepy stuff that still lingers in the game and probably hasn't aged particularly well. There is, uh, you know, the quite good, bad, and the ugly, but you know what I mean. It'll be interesting to see what's coming on. I'm looking forward to playing more of the game at least. Uh, outside from that, the other big series because we've been doing currently at the moment is uh, Final Fantasy X Part II, uh, which has been rolling along. Um, good news in that there's, um, we were through the majority of it, we're now just starting to come on to chapter 5, just gone up the video uh, lately for our first ship to VN Infinito, which is the big super dungeon, uh, and we've got lots of stuff to clear out for that. Now, very wisely, uh, the, some of this video stuff you're watching, like this video here, this was recorded like nearly a month ago. Um, I basically binge recorded 10-2. Um, over the course of about two weeks, and I basically played virtually the entire game in the spawn of that, um, as you go through here. Uh, we've got, yeah, another dozen videos that are already pre-recorded and ready to go on. Now, it should be noted that I haven't actually recorded, um, the rest of the game. I've still got a couple of, like, super boss things to do, and then we actually have the end of the game to play through. Uh, and then I still do want to have a delve into, uh, Last Mission, uh, which is kind of like, uh, I don't know, I've never actually played it before, but it's kind of set after Final Fantasy X-2 is. There's a few months down the line. It does involve YRP uh, as such, but it's a completely different kind of experience, and I've never really played it before, so I do intend to cover that for the purposes of the series. Um, I do need to sit down and do something like that because I haven't actually touched the game in like two or three weeks. Uh, so going back into that to, you know, take on super bosses could be interesting. I guess that's for me to work out, but uh, plainly going for that. Uh, hopefully, uh, both of those series will be complete in time for the uh, release of Silent Hill 2 Remake, which of course is due out in the beginning of October. Uh, I do intend to be doing that series on release. Uh, we've been having a stream goal currently, and see here, uh, raising the cash on the side to get myself a PlayStation 5 so that I can actually get out of Silent Hill 2 on release because my PC is going to struggle to be able to play the game on it and record it and it's just going to struggle to do it. Uh, so I'm going to go get a console to go do that. I've got the, um, I've got a capture card. I've got a good one in, in the PC to be able to do that. So that is the plan. So hopefully Final Fantasy 10 2 and Proud City for Birthday will be both concluded before that begins. That is the plan. Other thing I'm going to mention as well is that we have also been been uh, uploading bits and pieces for Resident Outbreak. Uh, we've made our return on it for the channel um, over the past few weeks or so on stream on Twitch. Uh, we returned for the Terra mod, uh, as was one back in September of last year. Yeah, it's been... It's been a journey, it's all I can say, kids, in that time. Uh, it was one uh, to play through a modded version of the game, uh, and we managed to get flowed of uh, a lot of the old team as well, Azumi, Jugs, Legal, and some others have swung along for some of this as well. Uh, the final video of the Terra mod uh, has just gone up. Uh, that is our last stand run on Desperate Times Hard. We have not played 
Uh, we have one more stream of the Terror Mod coming, uh, which is on Tuesday, where we're going to be looking to take on End of the Road. And then that is probably going to be it for the Terror Mod. Um, we have enjoyed our time. We've had some pretty wild experiences. Uh, this freaking fight with Nicks and Double Tyrants and some wacky stuff. Like, we knew going in it was going to be a challenge, and it definitely is designed to be that way. But we have largely enjoyed our time. Uh, I should also note as well, we have spent the last couple of Tuesdays also also playing another mod, uh, the Apocalypse mod, uh, which we also gave a spin. I was uh, contacted by one of the lead devs for that to give it a spin. Our response to that has been a little more mixed, truth be told. Um, I don't think we've liked it quite as much. Still been okay, although I don't believe that that is going to be making the YouTubes because I've only got so much time now to be doing bits and pieces and time spent like porting those across and editing those and processing them, getting uploaded is stuff that I could be spent doing probably more worthwhile things, uh, all things being told. So that is that. But uh, yeah, we've got the last stream for both of those mods on Tuesday on Twitch. And then, I don't know. Um, the odds are we probably will do some more Outbreak. Of course, normally September is the month where we do the, uh, the Raffle Raffle in previous years. I don't quite know if that's going to work out this time. I know saying that as it's, you know, freaking August 30th. It's not ideal, but that's how it's kind of been. But there will probably be some more Outbreak on Twitch, which will find its way onto the YouTubes before the year is out, I imagine. But I can't... I can't sit here and tell you the exact specifics right now. I don't 100% know. Mention the Twitch as well. Uh, probably swing on over here. We're seeing good. Uh, we have been fairly busy and fairly consistent on Twitch over the past six to eight weeks, actually. We've been streaming most Tuesday and Saturday nights. It is now September. So if you wish to throw me money and uh, make Jeff Bezos give me some of his, uh, then you can save up to 8% on new subs until October the 1st. And I uh, say so we are making our final push towards... Uh, Getting the money aside for the PlayStation 5 for Sam to remake. Uh, anyone who does contribute that, I hugely appreciate it. Uh, there's also contribution being made as well across over on the Patreon at patreon.com slash blackchannel I'm free. Uh, and I do appreciate everyone that both does has contributed and is contributing as well. I do humbly appreciate it. It is, um, you know, it, it's nice to know that that is there, um, you know, to build up the refunds. So that the channel is able to be self-sufficient at this point, which is really darn awesome. But yeah, we've been pretty busy. Um, streaming it over the past few weeks on Twitch, we've been going through our sh the Steam gift medleys um, uh, with a variety of games that were thrown my general direction over the course of uh, the summer, and we've been playing loads of them, all sorts of things. Uh, we've been playing plenty of Vampire Survivors, it's been a lot of fun. Uh, we gave like, a Bayonetta a spin. Uh, we went and recently played the second chapter of The Coffin of Andy and Lily, which has been... An experience, I think, is the best way to describe it. Uh, we've also been doing bits and pieces as well. So I'm playing all sorts of games uh, this Saturday. Uh, we're doing more Vampire Survivors as well as the second shift on the Mortary Assistant, uh, which is a fun game set to, you know, as the assistant in a mortician's house, which has become haunted by demons. And not only are we trying to, you know, like, do our job, we're also trying to stop them from, you know, entering our world. It's a bit awkward. Uh, so we're doing a second one of those on Saturday night. It might also be my last stream on Vampire Survivors, but I don't know. We we have done a lot on it. The game is a rabbit hole, and it's like every time you think you're done, there's suddenly there's more stuff to be done. It's kind of amazing how much of it there is. Uh, but uh, regardless, I think we've got one more show in there, and then that might be it, at least for the time being. Um, because I don't quite know how the streaming is going to look going forward. Because I'm going to try to do two streams a night, uh, two streams a week on this channel. And I'm trying to do a stream a week over on the other channel and with the other stuff that I'm doing. Um, you know, with like, you know, the, the, the refereeing stuff. And I have other comments as well. It's like every single evening at the moment, I've got something on. Um, and it's a bit much. And that's not even including setting time aside to be doing recording or anything like that. So it's very possible that this might soon be going back to uh, a night a week streaming. And to be fair, even the Dune stuff, that's like, it's not even been as frequent as it should be. Um, so I'm going to have to sit down at some point and kind of work out how that's all going to work out. There are occasions I've just done streams with no mic, uh, with Vampire Survivors, because I need to be up, like, 
uh, very late because I'm doing the night shift the following evening. So I've spent some time just doing stuff like that. Um, but it's kind of very ad hoc here, not particularly consistent. So um, probably by the next update next month, I'll have you a bit more of an idea of where everything like that stands. As mentioned, all roads do lead to Sun Hill 2 Remake, which is due out on October the 8th of this year. Um, as I mentioned, I do intend to uh, do this series on release, um, and I'll be looking to keep an evening or two free around when this comes out so that I can get on with some recording and bits and pieces. Um, so that should be good times. I am looking forward to it. I think it will be a really good experience. I do think the game has some very high expectations to fill, mind you, but I have faith that it will be a good uh, a good time. Part of me is maybe ever so slightly pensive because of my time spent Resident Evil 4 remake, which of course, as I said, was, you know, was a really good and well put together game. Um, but I do think it was like just missing a little something about it that I think was just like that missing ingredient which stopped it from like being like a really truly exceptional game in my in my opinion. Silent Hill 2 is and Silent Hill as a series is definitely very different in kind of the way it's always been portrayed. So we'll see how that plays out. But I do think that this will be a, a really, really good experience. And uh, you know, for those of you that are gonna be popping along to watch along. Uh, and usually when I do these series, uh, you know, like Resident Evil and whatnot, you know, there's there's one or two folks that say they, they'll wait until my series to watch it. Like, I do appreciate that because, of course, there is no end of channels out there that will be covering this when it comes out. And obviously, probably some of them beforehand as well. Um, so for those that are willing to swing along and uh, see my take of it, it will be much appreciated. Uh, but that's going to do it for this. Going to keep this update fairly short, fairly brief. Um, as I say, as far as this month's concerned, um, we have got, uh, yeah, the last bits of the Outbreak uh, Terror mod. When we get that done on Tuesday, uh, and we'll be going through the rest of Final Fantasy X-2 and Parasite Eve Third Birthday, and looking to get both of those finished up before the end of the month, so that we're ready for Silent Hill 2 Remake on October the 8th. And uh, that's what's coming for the channel. Uh, one other thing, actually, I also may mention, well, I've just quickly thought about it, uh, over on Twitch, as far as is concerned, uh, I have been gotten talked into uh doing a randomizer run for uh for castlevania symphony of the night one of the things we also did as part of the um of the variety streams is uh, i actually played um castlevania uh aria of sorrow i believe it was um and by doing that i hadn't played castlevania since symphony of the night which was several years ago and i did quite enjoy the experience i've been talked into uh, playing a Symphony of the Night randomized run, um, and I've recently been told that apparently the DS games have uh, actually become available on certain platforms as well, uh, which is also pretty neat. So it's possible we might be delving into more Symphony of the Night content, and if I do, that'll probably be making its way onto the YouTube as well. But uh, anyways, that is us going to do it here. So very much for watching, everyone. Uh, enjoy your weekends. Hopefully you enjoy the content, and uh, yeah, we'll see you if not for any of this, hopefully we'll see you in about five weeks. Take care, everyone. I'll see you soon.